Welcome to the Spring Group. My name is Tim, I'm a postdoc here. My name is Sonia, I'm also a postdoc here. And I'm Mia, I'm a third year PhD student. So our group works on chemical biology, which means that we're using organic synthesis to develop tools that manipulate biological systems. Our aim is to develop next generation therapeutics, for example, anti-cancer and antimicrobial drugs. So, uh, there are around 25 people working here and the group is divided uh, into two subgroups. One is dealing with biotherapeutics, such as therapeutic peptides or antibody drug conjugates. And the other one is focused more on small molecule synthesis for medicinal chemistry, for example, protein degraders uh, that are also known as protax. So, let's go to the lab and look how a typical day in the spring group looks like. So we're starting off with wet lab organic synthesis. Most people in our group are chemists by training, which also reflects the major task of our research, which is chemical synthesis of compounds. Here you can see how it is currently making peptides from natural as well as non-natural amino acids. As well as protein modification in tiny reactors, here you can see, for example, this little thermal shaker. In one or the other way, you may obtain the desired compound, but chemical reactions rarely run perfectly, so the next very important step is compound analysis and purification. For these, we use a range of classical methods, such as thin layer chromatography and column chromatography. The group possesses with automated LCMS, which allows quick and accurate analysis of reaction mixtures. And one of the best thing about LCMS is that we don't need to share it with anyone else, as it is our own. HPLC machines and Combi Flash. We are lucky enough to be able to obtain preliminary biological data in-house. For this, we use our plate reader. Or gel rocker. For more elaborate biological outcomes, we collaborate with our industrial partners such as AstraZeneca or with academic groups at the Department of Pharmacology and Biochemistry in Cambridge. If you're interested in our research, follow us on Twitter, visit our website or drop us an email. We hope to see you soon.